Welcome to the channel with your friend Blessed Row. Southern cooking is the best, that's one thing we all know. Most comforting meals that everyone will love. Join Blessed Row, her cook. Hello everybody, I hope that you all are having a wonderful day. I have already put my ground beef in the pot, as you can see, and you can hear it. So we're gonna go ahead and season up this ground beef. I have a quarter of a medium yellow onion that I diced and a quarter of a medium bell pepper. This bell pepper, you know how bell peppers, some of them have three, some of them have fours, so this one's in fours. I'm gonna put that in. We're going to add in some garlic powder. We're going to add in some onion powder and a little bit of seasoning salt and some black pepper. I'm not adding that much seasoning salt because we're going to be using some beef broth, which is salted. But we do want to add in some seasoning salt because we want our meat to be seasoned. I'm gonna go ahead and brown this meat up and we'll be back once the meat finishes browning. Before our meat gets completely brown, I'm gonna add in a teaspoon of minced garlic. I'm gonna go ahead and drain most of our grease from our meat and I'll be back. I drained out most of the grease and now I'm adding in my rasteroni. You can use Spanish rice or Mexican, whichever one you can find. So we're gonna go ahead and toast up our rasteroni. I, oh, I put a hole in the middle, space in the middle. And we put our rice in here, but we're just gonna toast it all up together. I saw a channel on YouTube making a recipe similar to this. I can't remember what the channel was at this time, but if I remember what it is, I will be sure to put it in the description box. It's not exactly like this, but I, I this recipe was inspired by that. So we do want to get our rasteroni toasted up pretty good. Let me know in the comments if you like rasteroni and what's your favorite kind. Now 
Y'all know it smells so good in here. So today I wanted me something good to eat and I couldn't think of nothing good. I and just the thought of some of the takeout places just makes me like ill. <laughs> but I decided I'll make me something good myself. Because I can cook. All right, now I have two cups of beef broth. I'm going to stir that in. And I also have the seasoning packet that came with the rice aroma. I'm going to open that up. I have one can of Rotel tomatoes. I'm using the mild. I'm gonna stir that in. And I have one can of drained corn. As we see, this has come to a boil, so I'm gonna cover it and I'm gonna let it simmer for 20 minutes. That's the instructions on the rasaroni. It says simmer the rasaroni for 20 minutes or until the rice is tender. So we're gonna simmer this for 20 minutes covered until or until the rice is tender. So it's already come to a boil. Now you can taste this, and if it's something you think you need to add, go ahead and add. We'll be back. Let's cover this and simmer it. Our 20 minutes are up and the rice is looking scrumptious. I have some queso fresco cheese. I'm gonna put that. I'm gonna crumble a little bit of that on here. And I have me some cheddar cheese. I'm gonna put some of that on here. We're gonna cover this up and we're gonna let it melt and we're gonna plate this up and see how delicious it is. Let's cover it up, let it melt, and we'll be back. The cheese has melted. Look how delicious it looks. So I'm gonna stir this cheese around and then we're gonna plate it up. Stay tuned for the plate up. Look at this rice. I put a little bit of parsley on it, y'all. Don't this look good? Oh my goodness, we do. A, I had to do a zoom in for y'all. It looks so good. It smells so good. I'm getting ready to taste it. I plated it up. Y'all see I put some cheese on it and some parsley. I am so excited. I'm ready to taste it. Look at that. Mm, yummy deliciousness. If you want to see more delicious recipes, go ahead and hit subscribe. Also, while you're there, go ahead and give me a thumbs up for this video. Thank you so much for joining me today. Remember to always put God first in everything that you do. Join me again next time on Bless Row Cooks. Turn on your TV screen. Turn on your phone. Turn on your laptop. We're watching Bless Row. Let's roll.